Patriots owner said that he gave Russian President Vladimir Putin his Super Bowl ring. But the real story is, is that Putin stole it. That's what Kraft admitted Thursday, according to the New York Post. He let Putin try the ring on, and when he stuck his hand back out to get it back, Putin put it in his pocket, was surrounded by three KGB guys, and walked out of the room. Yeah, Kraft went so far as to try to get the government to intervene, but was told by an official in the White House, quote, it would be in the best interest of U.S.-Soviet relations if you say it was a gift. If you got it back, it would be a dangerous way to make top plays. Here's the top plays from last night. History being made in the World of Horse Racing. Hall of Fame jockey Johnny Velasquez winning his 5,000th race in the United States and Canada. He guided Galloping Giraffe, I love that name, to victory at Belmont Park. And then paid tribute to Jack Ramon Dominguez, who announced his retirement yesterday after winning 4,985. Number nine, Tigers and Twins. Jamie Carroll sliding stop the throw to Justin Mordo and a nice pick there as well. Well, he better play some D. He's hitting 205 as the Twins' leadoff hitter. Needed the defense. He did some O yesterday, too. Red Sox and Orioles, a fly ball down the left field line. Daniel Nava slide on over. A great sliding catch there. Stopped himself right before the wall. However, his team needed some offense. Red Sox lose two zip. Brewers and the Reds, bottom 10. Game tied at three. No more. They call him Bruce. Jay Bruce and my team, those Cincinnati Reds, are winners 4-3 on the sixth career walk-off home run for Jay Bruce. Justin Hicks making it look easy. All right, Wyandotte, Michigan, just outside of Detroit, Justin Hicks. That one. Hicks finished the round with a score of 73. Let's do some cricket. ICC champion trophy. Take the West Indies of South Africa. And Chris Gale juggling catch. West Indies got that but would lose to the South Africans. Scram all over cricket today on Sports Center. Back to the U.S. Open. John sent in his third shot on the fifth hole. Puts well outside the green. The ball makes a big turn towards the cup. I read that well. Somehow finds the hole. He finishes the round with a 71. Hey, everybody is. Need to beat the courts. Tigers and Twins. Tory Hunter. Man, he can still play some defense. Shoestring catch there. Gets it. Tigers would end up scoring four in the sixth as well. They got a four nothing win over Minnesota. He makes things like that look effortless. White Sox, Astros, Chris Carter, the rocket to short. Not going anywhere. How about the ups for Alexi Ramirez? There's a better view right here. He gets on up there. The White Sox, however, would lose 2 1. Number one from the Phillies and the Rockies. High chopper in the infield. Here's Nelson Arenada. Look at that barehanded grab and throw. Makes the play. And on the day that they lost Troy Tulowitzki for four to six weeks with a broken rib, they lost to the Phillies 8-7 despite that play. What do you think of uh, Billy Horschel's chance of the U.S.?